So we have breaking news out of Renton right now. All right, reports of a car ramming into a Walgreens there early this morning. So with more, we want to go to Fox 13's Dan Griffin at the scene. Dan, what's the situation there right now? Well, I can tell you the front end of this store is just smashed in. I'll get out so you can see it. I mean, whatever vehicle did this did a bang up job on the front of this Walgreens. Something that I noticed, uh, it looks like the ATM is tilted sideways and from where I'm standing and I tried to have a zoom in on this too. It looks like the inside of that ATM has been ripped out. Now I'm not 100% sure if that's what happened here. I can't tell yet, um, but that's kind of what it looks like. We've been here through the morning. Police were here earlier and have now left. So. The only person here really at the moment, it appears, is a manager who's trying to keep watch on the store until they can get this dealt with. But it appears at some point early this morning, a vehicle plowed right into this Walgreens store here, uh, made a huge mess, ripped down whatever protective barrier they had. And then that ATM, from what I can tell, from where I'm standing, it looks like it was knocked sideways and the inside of it ripped out. Now, we're still working to get more information officially from Renton Police, so we'll work on that through the morning and try to get you the very latest. But for now, a really big mess at this Walgreens, and people are stopping by as they're making their morning commute, and they're just like, wow, because it is just such a big mess. So we'll be here through the morning, bring you the very latest as we get it. For now, we're live here in Renton. Dan Griffin, Fox 13 News.